Is it really the elephant in the room? Hi, my name is Rose. This is the School of Mathematics in Nigeria. It feels good to be back. <laughs> All right, so you might be wondering why is everybody talking about JAM and what is this JAM all about? It is the Joint Admissions and Matriculation Board. This is a board responsible for an examination called the UTME, right? So every student who is willing to write the UTME is getting prepared to get an admission into a university, a polytechnic or a college of education in Nigeria, specifically in Nigeria. UTM is the Unified Tertiary Matriculation Examination. The registration exercise began on the 15th of January and ended on the 26th of February 2024. Please correct me if I am wrong, but if I am not, let's go on. So um, on your registration slip, you're going to get your registration number, the time, the venue, the date, and every other necessary information that you would need to know, right? I have two youtube pages that are very good they tell you everything that you need to know about this registration your jam the subjects and all of that one is chubby chemistry studies you can check him out and the other person is medic wealth you can also check him out i'll leave their links in the description box okay so you can visit of course you can visit the website which is www.jam.gov.ng for more details sometimes you have to read by yourself to get this information and other times of course you have to learn or listen to somebody who has an experience from this same thing right okay so now let's get to the elephant in the room mathematics the jam syllables for mathematics okay if you want to get the syllables for these subjects just go to ibas.jab.gov.ng I hope I pronounced it right, but it's I-B-A-S-S-S dot jam dot gov dot N-G. You'll get the syllables. When we say syllables, we mean these topics that you might come across in your jam exam or in your UTME. Okay. All right. So for mathematics, we have five sections, right? We have the algebra. We have number and numeration. We have geometry and trigonometry. We have calculus and of course, statistics. And for these sections, we have subsections. Do not worry. It might seem like a lot, but do not worry. Once you know or have an idea on one topic, mm -hmm, am I supposed to say it like that? But once you have an idea on something in math, it just keeps going taking you to other things it's like a string or how am i supposed to say it? like there is a connection so once you understand the topic you keep going to the next topic you keep seeing why you had to learn the topic before that topic i hope it makes sense but don't worry in the next coming days like videos more videos will show you why or explain to you what i am trying to talk about right do not worry, by God's grace, we are back and we're back to stay. So help us God. Amen. Amen. So yeah, um, there's also an app. Before I forget, there is also an app I would like you to check. It's called the Class 54 app. It's not a sponsored video. I just like to talk about things that are good and would help you, right? So this app would help you to check um, questions and answers and even solves them for you it's like an AI thing if I'm not mistaken um, all you need to do is register you just log in your email number create a password just sign up and then see what it's about I think you have to pay for exclusive or premium services like getting more questions but if you are not willing to pay it's still fine I think there's a free version too I, I, I checked the app last year um, so I've not checked it this year to see the updates on it, but it's a very good app that I advise you to check. So on, at this junction, so of this course you know this is a good time to subscribe. If you haven't, turn on the post notification so that you can get notified once there's a video up for you. And of course, like, share, tell a friend to tell a friend that the School of Mathematics is back. Thank you. It feels good to be back, actually. Good to see you, good to have you here and uh, I can't wait to see you again.